sir. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. Uh, 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 uh. Hold on. It's your boy, Thomas Carter. And I'm here. Back at it again with another video. Yes, sir. Now, <clears throat> I was just sitting here like, I just got off the phone, you feel me? With my, with my, with my woman and my girlfriend. And um, I was just sitting here thinking cause I really wasn't gonna like upload a video today. But I'm like, nah, like let me just, let me just tune in with the channel. You know, um, there's something about like being on attention and being on no fact. That's like, even if you not really in the mood to do something, you go and do it. You feel me? Because you're learning to be more like in control of your emotions, and you're learning to let go of procrastination. So. I was gonna wait till tomorrow to upload, but I'm like, nah, let me just upload now. Get it out the way, talk to the channel. And um, continue to get that positive hit of dopamine from uh, doing what I love to do. You know what I mean? Which is talking to y'all, real talk. And I added value to myself and I added value to the people. Now, I'm constantly like asking myself on a day-to-day -day basis, how can I, as an individual, add more value to the marketplace. And, um, <clears throat> me learning, bro, like, just about retention and no fap and just, like, this community and this marketplace, there are people out there in the world that do need help, you know, breaking their pornography addiction. And, um, they do need help, like, really taking retention serious and seeing the bigger picture. So, you know, my eyes be so wide open. But like, realistically, I I want to at least express to y'all, I got some uh, benefits that I broke down just off of my personal experience. I want to express to y'all the importance of retention, the importance of no fat, and as just as this uh, as this channel continues to grow, we got more work to do. You know what I'm saying? We as in us as a community and. Me as in myself, just working on myself on a day to day basis. Now, shout outs to everybody, of course, in the Seamer Attention No Fat community. Shout outs to everybody at this point the channel. If this is your first time to the channel, all I ask is that you hit the subscribe button, give today's video a thumbs up, and leave your comments below. Literally that simple. Right top. Um, I'm gonna show y'all. Not, not this page right here, but this page. So, this is the notes for today's video. I got like two pages of notes. So, um, so there's a lot that I do want to express to y'all, bro. What's up? Now, I ain't going for it. Shout out to God, you know. Thank you, God, for this experience. Thank you, God, for this knowledge and this awareness of being on attention, being on no fat. Bro, talk. Things do, you know, become more clear and you do stay in alignment when you're on retention you know what i'm saying it's really that that driving force that's going to help you in life you know help you in general and retention is here for your for your greater good you know like your, your energy is here to serve you and as long as you're taking care of it it will take care of you in every way shape or form you know what i'm saying um i also too of course Y'all see it if you are watching. Shout out to my baby, Marvelous, real tough. The reason why I want to give her a shout out is to be honest with y'all, bro. Like, <clears throat> when you have a solid woman in your corner that's taking your retention journey just as serious as you are, like, you gotta be grateful. Cause I ain't gonna front, bro. Like, a lot of women, they don't really know the importance of a man retaining his seed. And. <clears throat> A lot of people just in general ain't going to get it. They ain't going to understand the journey, bruh. Real talk. But I learned, bruh, like God really manifested us into each other's reality. You know what I'm saying? And one day she will be on the channel. So, um, 
for the time being, though, I definitely do got to give her a shout out. And I got to say thank you for real talk. Because that, that really means a lot to me. I ain't going to front. Teamwork make the dream work. Now, first thing I want to talk about is uh, the long-term thinking. Long-term thinking. That's very important for your, for your human experience. You know? Trusting in the process. When you're going through this process of change, you have to have faith in the unknown. When you're going through this process of change, you have to adapt to this better version of yourself. You have to be more open to receiving. You have to reprogram your mind because your mind has been through a lot of negative conditioning to where you think that it is, you think that it's fake like normal to think like worst case scenario about things and not really be like an optimistic person. You know, um, a lot of the world is based off of like instant gratification, and a lot of things that we may get in life, right, you may, may want it instantly. But there is a long term journey that you have to look forward to, and there is a long term thinking process that you have to apply into your reality. You know, now. I want y'all to break free from porn, break free from masturbation addiction, and go like the rest of your life with being free of porn. Cause like, you don't wanna reach a certain amount of days, you reach two months, three months free of porn, you reach a half a year free of porn, and then you have this one thought of watching porn just so you can feel good in that present moment and then you go back to the old habits and the old ways. So you don't want that to happen. Or you have the chaser effect, where now you get to watch this, this video, that video, that video, and now you're going back to, to just releasing, releasing, releasing. You don't want to have that, 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 that way of thinking, you know? You don't want to be doing that to yourself. You want to change the way that you think, pay attention to how you feel, and know that retention is, is for your greater good, it's for your long-term benefit, it's to benefit you for the rest of your life. This is energy, this is life force energy. If you're not gonna bring another version of you, a 2.0 of you into this reality, what, what you about to spill your seed for? It's like, it's like having a, it's like having a, a, a cup full of water and you pouring the water out, not even caring about the fact that you need this water to survive. You need this water to live, you feel me? But you just pouring it out. With no care. That's why. You know what I'm saying? Don't do that. Don't do that. This is where the self-control, this is where the self-discipline comes into play. This is why it's important for y'all to, to apply those things to your retention journey, bro. You know what I mean? Shout out to the fireman. Come on. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. Let the, let the fire truck go by. Now, when you think when you think long term and when you learn how to how to actually like keep your cup full and give it time for you know God to allow it to overflow, you learn like the importance of patience and you learn that great things really take time. And like when you really delay your gratification, bro, you just naturally feel better. You just naturally feel more like in the in the flow. You know, because you know that you're doing the right thing. All right. The second thing I have written down is to put in the work, man. Put in the work. All right. The grind gets better. Live from the soul. And I'll be the first to say, bro, like sometimes I ain't gonna front, bro. Like sometimes I'll be in my ego and I'll be having to simmer that down, bro. But I ain't gonna front. I'm, I'm still, I'm still learning. I'm still learning life. I'm still learning myself and I'm still learning, bro. Like, you don't always have to be in your ego. You feel me? Like, for instance, for instance, bro, like, like your ego really wants to, to, to like defend you and keep you in like protective mode. So sometimes, like, let's just say somebody may say something negative about you and you may take it hey, personal. So but like, we'll do is it your yeah, ego yeah. taking it personal or is it, because, like, your spirit, your soul, your higher self, 
the aura and the energy is so strong, it's like not that hard for you to deflect negative energy or negative words. But sometimes like the ego, the ego could, could feel like bruised and hurt and hurt and stuff like that. So I be having to just catch myself, like not being in my ego so much. And like I said, living from the spirit. You know what I'm saying? Yeah, I um, As far as putting in the work, you know, bro, you gotta enjoy the process, enjoy the grind, bro. Like there's so much things that we could do in this human experience outside of just like using our energy to watch people fornicate, using your energy to watch endless amounts of porn, using your energy to just fornicate. Not like watching people fornicate and just fornicate just in general. Like there's so much things you could do with this energy outside of that. It's so, like me, I'm out here. Like I see it, I'm out here every day. We'll be each by feeding the people, man. Protecting my energy, you know, and adding value to the YouTube channel. You know what I'm saying? Continue to work on the things that I've been working on, X, Y, Z, and I, I've been enjoying it. I've been enjoying it, even down to the ground with the stock market, bro. I just I study, I study the markets. Markets fluctuate, markets go down. I be like, let's go! More opportunity, more discount. I'm like working on my my money psychology. You feel me in a way, and I'm breaking this like. It be so much like reconditioning and reprogramming that you gotta do that I, I be catching myself doing every day, bro. Like just having a stronger relationship with money, having a stronger relationship with the way that I view money, having a stronger relationship with myself. You know what I mean? Like things like that. And not being programmed to think like to think in scares. Cause that's literally programmed, literally. It could be, it's all from outside sources. Literally, it's all from outside sources. But if you give your energy, if you give your energy to the abundance that you feel and that you know it's out here, then that's what you're gonna attract, right? Um, next thing I have written down is build from the ground up and stay the course. Everything takes time. For me, plant good seeds and understand like you gotta, you gotta. Hold on, let me take you back up there. Here we go. Planting good seeds, and you gotta have good soil when you plant the good seeds, right? So, things require patience, time, consistency, effort, and energy. And you cannot plant good seeds with a negative mindset, with a negative mentality. You know what I'm saying? So, you gotta really, really focus inward and know what you want for yourself and have faith in the things that you want have faith in the unknown in the unseen you know what i'm saying like real talk and stay the course don't ever give up bruh everybody start from day one of retention everybody start from from zero dollars in their stock market journey everybody start from zero subscribers in their youtube journey everybody started from a sperm cell 40 Manifested here on planet Earth. Like we all got the starting point. But like as long as you don't give up, as long as you don't quit, you'll always enjoy the journey, bro. Alright? Next thing I have written down is unlimited energy for you to take advantage of. So on the semen retention and no fab journey, bro, like you have to be all in with your energy. You gotta cultivate it. You have to allow it to to flow within and you gotta allow it to help you in life. Help you heal, help you grow, help you elevate, help you expand help you break your limited beliefs, help you become more confident in yourself, you know, help you love yourself unconditionally. Real talk, energy is everything, all right? Next thing I write down is to study stocks and investments, you will thank yourself. That's that's just a fact. That's just a fact, right? If you study the markets, if you study how money works, if you study your stock market chart, you start studying companies and envisioning yourself owning businesses and things like that, You'll definitely see a bigger picture. You know what I'm saying? So, <laughs> but if you, that's like a lot, a lot, a lot of people feel like they don't know where to start or like what companies to invest in and X, Y, and Z, or they feel like they can't do it. You can't give yourself excuses, bro. You have to just do it because there's everything that's against you when it comes down to like not investing. Like, save your money, invest your money, and then make more money. That's what I remind myself, bro. Make more money, bro. Talk. Make more money, bro. And and keep on investing, cause it's always a bigger picture. 
it's always a bigger picture. Three years, four years, five years, ten years down the line, fifteen years down the line, it's all gonna make sense. It's all gonna make sense, bro. And, and understand it, understand, bro. Like the stock market is really how people build wealth. Outside of like owning a business, bro. The stock market is how people build wealth, bro. I'm, I'm just telling you, real talk. You just gotta stay consistent. And believe in it. Word. Alright? Next thing I have written down is do things that interest you. Your dopamine receptors will be reset. Alright? That's number six. You get a negative hit of dopamine from watching porn, from releasing sleep, you get brain fog, you probably have like uh, um, post night clarity, right? Um, premature ejaculation and things like that, right? You get a negative hit of dopamine from like. Doing things that's not really like helping you in life. I ain't going front, right? So switch it, switch the mindset. Switch, like literally do the things that, that interest you in your real life reality that actually keep you happy, that actually make you happy and allow your dopamine receptors to be reset it to a more positive like outlook on life, to a more positive like feeling. You know what I'm saying? If that makes sense. So, word. Because you're definitely going to be reprogramming your mind a lot. And you're definitely going to get a positive hit of dopamine for more positive things. Because you're on retention. Because you're on no fat. You know what I mean? You're no longer, you're no longer like dimming yourself and dumbing yourself down with pornography. Alright? Number seven. Heal your mind. Reconditioning requires a new way of thinking. All right, your mind is very, very powerful. Probably the most powerful thing that you have, and you have to heal it. You got to heal it from the reconditioning, from the reprogramming, from the, from the bad programming and stuff like that, bro. And you gotta, you gotta think differently. This is what retention forces you to do. Think differently. It forces you to face yourself. Any type of bad thinking you might have had, you gotta ask yourself where did it stem from? And why were you thinking that way? So now it's forcing you to hold yourself accountable for a better way of thinking. And for you to create a better life for yourself with your thoughts, you know, and your energy and your actions and X, Y, Z. All right? Number eight, really protect your energy and your subconscious mind, okay? Reps and consistency is key. So one thing I had to, I had to learn is perfect example. Investing into the stock market, I had, to, I had to build the repetition to invest, 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 do it over, do it again. Next day, do it again. Look at the chart. Hey companies here let's invest some more do it again repetitions i had to keep on doing it same thing with working out push-ups pull-ups dips squats lunges do it again over and over and over and over it's it's you're building that you know what i'm saying and you gotta you gotta stay true repetitions is re repetition is key you feel me the more repetitions you are with something the better you get at it it's perfecting the craft you know team retention Day one, day two, day three, day four, day five, day six, day seven. Probably be last after one week, but I'ma get back to it. Day one, day two, then you, you feel me? You just stay the course. Then you hit a month, then you hit two months, then you hit three months, then you hit four months, then you hit six months, then five, six, seven, eight, nine. You feel me? You gotta stay repetitious. You can't quit, you can't give up. You gotta think, you gotta think of it like this too, right? You've already been very, very repetitious when it comes down to watching porn. So you built that habit and that, that way of of thinking and being to the point where that's all that you know but this is why you gotta break it you gotta break the habit and think of something different know yourself as somebody totally different than the point addict that's within you all right and protect your subconscious mind remember your subconscious mind is your subconscious mind controls your conscious your conscious mind let's just keep it real your subconscious mind controls your conscious decisions that you make so if you grow a stronger subconscious you will grow a stronger conscious mind and you will make better decisions in life all right smarter decisions too the amount of focus is amazing and you'll perform better in the things that you do that's another thing i have written down that's facts the focus is tenfold all right and the last thing i'm gonna leave you out with is um have faith in the things you want to create for yourself all right the bigger picture will all make sense like I said earlier in the video, plant good seeds with good soil. Break limiting beliefs 
You can't plant good seeds with a negative mindset. Always remember, always remember that you are a powerful creator. All right? So in order for us to create our best versions, we got to think differently. We got to have a stronger emotion, emotional stability, emotional intelligence. We have to be disciplined. We have to love ourselves unconditionally. We have to affirm to ourselves good things. We have to always remember our why. And we got to always remember it's bigger than just us. You know what I'm saying? Live from the spirit. Live from the spirit. All right? I want to say thank you to anybody that's been supporting this channel. Everybody in the Seaman Retention Lopez community, I want to say thank you to y'all. And um, thank you, God, for me once again. You know what I'm saying? I really do like appreciate y'all. I love y'all. Uh, thank myself too, man. Thank you, Terrence. I love you, bro. I appreciate you. Real talk. Unconditional love, my boy. Uh, you really been getting to it. You really been been making things happen, bro. Like, and I'm proud of you. Real talk. And once again, a huge shout out to my to my my baby. My baby, my valet, all right? I be saying my woman, cause it's like, bro, I'm holding that, like. When you say you got a girlfriend, that's like, being like, you're teenager. When you don't dealt with, it's like, nah, that's my woman, you feel me? But like, shout out to her, real talk. Um, if y'all enjoyed the content, though, if y'all gained something from today's video, give the video a thumbs up, subscribe to the channel, if this is your first time to the channel. Please leave your comments below. And I'll be back at it with some more content. It's a lot more work, man. It's a lot more uh, grit and grinding to be doing. And um, a lot more to look forward to. Real tough. But the spirit guides and your angels are with you at all times. And God is working with you every day. All right? Retain your seed and take your power back. Appreciate y'all. Love y'all.